Hey guys, uh, Livitz here, and I believe this will be the final part of our Soma playthrough. I looked through the achievements, and there's only one area, or one achievement left to get. So I'm assuming this whole area is the last bit, plus it's the space cannon, whatever. So I'm going to play until it's over. It could be 30 minutes, it could be an hour 30 minutes, I have, I have no idea. But anyways, let's go ahead and get into it. Also, I had started a recording to make sure my sound was right, and... Uh, he started some dialogue, so it's going to be cut a little weird there, but I wanted to at least include that. Anyways, let's get into this. It happens to have happened a hundred years ago. Sounds like a riddle. It does. I woke up in my bed today, a hundred years ago. <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? So, we are here. I guess we have to get to storage. I don't know what any of these colors mean. Now, was there any dialogue to have with her? It's crazy to think where I am. Man, I not only is this the future, it's in the middle of the sea. I know nothing of this time or what the world looks like. Not much to brag about now. Before the comet, I guess it was okay. Yeah. Better not oversell it. Might change my mind about the Ark. You seriously not going to tell me what happened to your arm? I had to make a quick stop at Site Alpha to help kill the WoW. What? How? Why? Stop it from torturing the memory of humanity. Okay, let's just get back to work. <laughs> what will I'm you do when you get into the Ark? Deep. What's the first thing? Make sure the Ark is safe, stabilize flight path, activate solar panels. Well, what's the first human thing you're gonna do? Oh. Watch the clouds roll by? Does that count? I'd say so. I like cloud watching. There, there can't be any monsters in this area, right? There can't possibly be. <coughs> Jesus. Should just jump down at that rate. Fuck. Initiate crouch sequence. It's a little blurry and it's hurting my eyes, so we'll go ahead and do this. I'm not sure why that heals me. I don't know if they ever... That there's some type of lore that, uh... Explains as such somewhere. still feels a little blurry to me, so maybe that did nothing. Maybe I'm just in a perpetual state of blurry because my arm is missing. It's not that dark. I'm not a fan of all this blood. Huh. All right, found the ark. Good job, Simon. Now we just to get need to find the assembly space so we can stuff the ark into a shell. Those ladders, that ladder. All 
these little sounds just get me. Gosh, there's still blood. Oh. Oh, is that Catherine? Are you suggesting we keep it down here? <clears throat> Doesn't that defeat the whole purpose? Eternity among the stars, remember? The people inside the Ark won't know the difference. We can just keep it down here, and we don't have to risk the Ark being shot through 5,000 meters of broken barrel, and then push through another 100,000 meters of a dust-filled atmosphere. Will the casing stand all that pressure? Well, the odds aren't great. Catherine, say something. I don't care what you think. I'm launching it. No need to be like that. Let's just hang on to it for a while and think about it. We can launch it later. No, that wasn't the deal. We needed to save them, to launch it. Out there, it's hope. Down here, it's a fucking terrarium waiting to die with the rest of us. Come on, Catherine. It's not asking much. Let's just think about it before we risk the only hope humanity has to survive this hell. No, we launch it today. This is my project, my arc. It's bigger than that. Don't you get it? It's not for you to decide. We're talking about the fate of mankind. Get away from the arc. I'm taking it. No, you're not. I'm not going to let you ruin this. Stop it. Guys, calm down. Get away from me. No. It was an accident. Catherine, talk to me. Catherine. Jeez. Oh God. Catherine. Did you say something? It's you. Dang it. You had an accident. What are you? Oh. You mean Catherine? A wrench. Don't worry. It's better this way. But I, I'm not understanding how this can be like salvation for humanity I mean we're just launching a simulation like how is this hope is there how hope that die? one day they can you got into a fight with your colleagues a real body? I don't they know. didn't want to risk launching the ark thought it might not make it through the atmosphere they killed me I'm sure it was an accident they with were a just trying to stop you from launching I think I found the assembly space what do you see it's like a huge open shell a bullet ready to be loaded that's great. All prepared for the Ark. On it. How could they kill me? Catherine. I know I'm not an easy person to like. I just thought they trusted me. Come on. Don't do this to yourself. There's so much dialogue in this section. Well, if blood is just her dead body, then... I'm not too worried. Did you have friends in Toronto, Simon? <laughs> Real friends? There were some. Jesse, Sean, Kevin. I always wanted a friend. Like a real one. Someone you'd never hold back <laughs> with. I thought we were friends. I'll be your friend. Oh, pity friendship? <laughs> now I feel even worse. What? Is my friendship not good enough? Jeez. Do you think the Ark will make it through the atmosphere and into space? It almost doesn't matter anymore. We just need to try. If we burn, we burn. If we're lucky, we just gave humanity a new chance, a whole new era. With the Ark on Earth, maybe we have a few decades of power to keep it running. In space, we have thousands of years. Still, one hell of a gamble, though. This was never about certainty. It's about hope. But is the hope that, like, they're gonna break out of the Ark one day? Find a way to break the simulation? That's what I'm a little confused by. Is it better to just live in the dream? Is what they're saying? I guess it's better than nothing at all. What a grim game. Is that it? 
I'm really not that familiar with guns of any size. Oh, here we go. All systems say go. Lock and load. Combat Falcon will head out to the gun. Now what? Now we just need to get the shell into the gun and then... kaboom. Aren't you forgetting something? How are you gonna get us on board the Ark? Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega Space Gun with your bare hands. You mean... it's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take the Omnitool and plug it in next to the seat and I'll guide you through the final steps. Is that supposed to pick up the uh, other thing in the tank? The power battery? knows the place you're supposed to go is the last place you go. Unless there's danger of it. Yeah, there's nothing. <laughs> I'm... I don't know. I think it's a questionable design shape. I guess it's meant to be a bullet. Easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. Bunch of buttons now. Uh, oh, that's pretty neat. Mm -mm. 
Okay, ready when you are. Just hit the button and we're off. But we need to transfer our minds to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches at all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. What's that yellow button? Did we push it? There's nothing else I could really do. What are you waiting for? Just bracing myself. Well, oh, push the button when you're done. Any more dialogue? You okay? Yeah. It's just crazy thinking about what we're doing. Ditching Earth. Boggles your mind, doesn't it? Any more dialogue? Come on, Simon, let's get going. <laughs> Push the button. Don't rush Keep me. Friends, Catherine. Soon we'll be among the stars. Let's hope so. Anything else? I think that's it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Finished loading just before it launched. Yeah, I saw. Then why are we still here? Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You were copied onto the Ark. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon and Omar Khan. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. This is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks. But our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a <laughs> spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. I'm sorry you feel that way, Simon. I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survives, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck. Fuck this. Fuck you. Fuck you, Catherine, you lied! And I believed in you, I trusted you! You said we're getting on the fucking Ark! We are on the Ark, you idiot! I didn't lie! I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance! You fucking- Fuck! Catherine? Please don't leave me alone. Let's say. Catherine? Please retry. Catherine? That's the end? Jesus Christ. Now there's two Simons just out and about in the deep. Odd. That was some really good voice acting, I think. 
Jared Zeus. And now Mooney. Hmm. I don't know if there's going to be anything after the credits, so we'll just hang here for a bit. But... <laughs> I'm not sure what to say. Um, it took eight videos to get here. And this is something I've wanted to do for a while. Not to, like, get any sort of notoriety or huge following any following really just to put myself out there for others to see create something that can hopefully make someone happy somewhere bring some type of enjoyment or entertainment to somebody um, to be honest I was in a pretty dark place before I started this series And, uh, <clears throat> I decided to just start it. You know, what the fuck? Might as well go for it. And the people I've met and started talking to, and the response I've gotten from the people who've decided to watch my videos or subscribe or like has just been amazing. <clears throat> um, all I can really say is just thank you. Is this? Did it work? Why am I so red? Did make a pretty world, didn't they? Calibration survey version 0.3. Welcome. If you're reading this, you've successfully entered the art. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. How would you describe your physical condition? I feel normal. How do you describe your mental condition? I feel normal. How do you describe your senses? As expected, normal. Yeah, we took this earlier. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant. He's given no indication that he's in some type of distress. Are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? A little bit. How do you perceive your new existence? <laughs> it's so strange. Do you think this new existence will be life worth living? I still like this answer. Would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? No. What if you put yes? Would it take you out? Mm. 
<clears throat> so how many people are loaded onto the Ark right now? And we read some stuff where they try to like play with NPCs being born as babies. Kathy? But I'm not sure. Catherine! I can't believe we actually made it. Well, we did. I'm so relieved. It's okay, Simon. Everything's all right now. Is this what the bullet always looked like? Until another comet just hits this random ass thing. Definitely an ending with mixed feelings. And like, if it is the end of humanity, what else are they supposed to hope for? Man. So much existential dread from that. <laughs> At the very least, they could have had like a kill switch, so he didn't have that realization that he was gonna die down there alone. But I guess, is that more? I don't know. You're killing someone in that instance. I don't know. And there's Catherine. See, it did switch, like I said from last episode. Oh, I can't even hit continue anymore. I guess I can load game. Yeah. Man. Oh, the face is splitting apart now. Yeah, what an, uh... What an intense experience. But as I was saying before, I am so thankful for everyone who's watched even one of my videos. Even if they didn't make it to this one, just the fact- just clicking on one of them makes my day. Whenever I go onto YouTube when I wake up and see that there's just one more view, either here or on TikTok or just one like or comment on Twitter, it's it's such an amazing feeling. And I'm so glad that for the people who have commented or liked my videos that you have gotten some enjoyment out of it and I couldn't be more appreciative of everyone watching this. Um, <clears throat> you guys have honestly brought me a lot of happiness in this past week and I couldn't be more grateful to every single one of you but this wraps up <clears throat> my playthrough of Soma and I have a backlog of other horror games I want to start playing um, I have Alien Isolation I have Outlast and I have Resident Evil Village um, I'm thinking I'll do Outlast next and that one's going to take a while to get through, I feel like, because I, I played it a couple years ago. Well, pff, more than a couple, probably like five years ago. And um, I maybe got 30 minutes into it to some part where you're like in a, you go to the basement and it's like the water up to your ankles and there's three guys padding around. And I stayed hungered in a locker trying to find out their pattern for two hours. And I did not leave because I was too scared. I'm hoping that I can handle it better this time. Um, but that just seems like the type of horror game that most horror YouTubers and streamers play at least at one point. So that'll probably be my next project to dive into. But like I also said on Twitter, my 
upload schedule will probably be a little slower than I did for this one because I want to start incorporating streaming into. Um, I started streaming Valorant. If you're interested, you can always check me out. Um, but I also plan on doing a little bit of variety streaming. There's some other streamers on YouTube or YouTube, on Twitch that I've been uh, in talks with and they've mentioned wanting to play games with me. And so if they allow me, I'll stream while I'm playing whatever game I want to play. But <laughs> I've, I've rambled on long enough. Again, thank you guys so much for taking this journey with me. And I hope I brought you some entertainment. And if you want, continue to look out for more uploads that I do in the future. I hope you guys have a great night and a great week. And I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you.